Tsunamis sweeping across the deep seas, hurricanes howling with deafening breeze, earthquakes shaking our tectonic plates, volcanoes erupting round earth as it breaks. Dinosaurs died and allowed man to stand. Millions of years changed the face of the land. A new world was born and with life it did flourish, enough natural resources to keep us all nourished. For a long time the man and the earth were as one. We drank from its rivers, bathed in light from the sun. The soil was rich and ideal for seeds. The planet attended to all of our needs. But earth for its pleasures could not comprehend the mentality of its so newly found friend. We used and consumed without fear or care. We scarred and we butchered a beauty so rare. Poisoning oceans and chopping down trees. Relaying landscapes to build as we pleased. Taking for granted our grand evolution. Seeds that were planted, replaced by pollution. Have you not wondered why it's so called Mother Earth? Throughout all of history it has given birth. This bluish green ball gently floating through space has potential for life quite like no other place. It gives and it gives and has nothing to ask. To treat it with love and respect is our task. For the moment the future we can't comprehend is the world as we know will soon come to an end. But there is still some time to undo what's been done, requiring our species to all act as one, with wind turbines turning and running on air, solar panels sourcing our sun's constant glare. We could cut our emissions and clean up with care, make it our mission to heal and repair, salvage and save for all that it's worth, secure our existence as people of Earth.